Hello. Hello, everyone. Welcome <laughs> to Feel It Real Fun, episode number 299, guys. God. Can you believe that? No. Nah. This all started with us making these little dinky, uh, well, first we did the coffee club videos. That's right. On uh, the <laughs> Google thing, right? Yeah. And then we went to the Periscope thing and did Periscope videos, which for some reason they kept making them yeah, narrow. Yeah, really narrow. And then they'd fix it and then they'd break it. And then we'd turn it to see, oh, maybe that works. No, it doesn't. Yeah, so <laughs> we did a few shows that were like that. It was just crazy. <laughs> yeah. So we've got our first live viewer has joined the show. It's episode Ooh, 299. Two, three, yeah, four, four. Oh my Ooh, God, this joined. is going to be great. Oops. Sorry. Oh, mercy, good Lord. Sorry. Don't do that. It upsets me. I've totally lost my state now. I'm a victim. <laughs> How do I stay in the state when Victoria so, keeps doing that stuff? Who has joined? Seven, eight people have joined. And, and we've nobody's seen commenting. No, nothing. That's all right. It'll all work out. Yeah. So, uh, this is th the super special show, 299. Your questions answered live at the top of the hour, which yes. is now... Beginning with, right. should I be calling my doctor? Actually, that's the second second one. <laughs> and eliminating debt and much, much more. Should I be calling my doctor? That and is hopefully we'll get to see your comments. We're yeah, not seeing nothing, so let's just pretend. Nothing. Ready? Oh, Yasmin is here. Joe is here. <laughs> Bob. Bob, 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 Bob Brisket Bob. Brisket Bob is Downtown here. Downtown with Pauline Brown. <laughs> Seriously, we're seeing no comments. <laughs> so, uh, it really is a bit bizarre. Yeah. Do we have to turn something on? No. Okay, sorry uh, you guys. Yeah, Facebook sorry. is Facebook. So let's do it, yep. Victoria. Yes. So let's start with the Neville Goddard quote. Yes. Uh, a reader email. Yes. Timeless wisdom of the ages. Yes. Another reader email. Yes. Another Neville Goddard quote. Wow. Oh my God, what a day, guys. <laughs> How what many reader emails have we day. got? Just two. Uh, just two. Just two. Yeah, okay. I was hoping for comments, but we have none. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Sorry, Facebook. you guys. Come on, guys. We will. I, I don't know. Whoever commented on yesterday's show will see that all of a sudden, yeah. your your comment was liked yesterday. That's right. <laughs> so we smartened up our act and actually had a look we at the show. We watched the show. Yesterday. We commented. We'll be doing we it love again doing today. That, so this is good. We like because, it because yeah, because we it really want to see your comments when we can't even see them now. <laughs> yeah, that's a bugger. All right. Okay. So Victoria. Yes. Shall we do the Neville Goddard quote or the reader email or what do you want to what, do first? Uh, let's do the, well, I don't know. Just the quote weaving for both of them. Yes. Let's read the quote. All right. Then, okay. So you see, nothing happens by accident. Nothing. Everything that happens in the world does so because you and I set them in motion, whether we do it wittingly or unwittingly. All righty. So now, the, the, but, uh, Bill, if you're in the house. <laughs> yeah. Put a, Put up a link to, if you're manifesting something bad, do this, which is on freenevel.com. Yes. All right. Okay. So, ready. Read yes. email number one. Yes. Hi, TT and V. Yes. If I want to see my debt gone, I yes. should see me telling a friend all about it and hear her and see her face while she does my nails saying congrats to me, question mark. Uh, she knows my monetary story from last year's, although since I know it's already gone, I don't tell the negative tale now. Okay, so I, so I get the scenario, right? Getting your nails done, yada, yada, yada. Instead of all deep, dark gloom. <laughs> yep. I need to yes. find what will work for me that I can believe and feel in real in regards to money and debt. Marion. All right. Okay. Want me to go or do you want to go first? Me go. All right. So, <clears throat> remember yesterday's show and probably a couple of them last week where I mentioned the puppies and Victoria mentioned puppy poop. Yes. Right? <laughs> so that you, was actually you, for yeah, Marianne, I think. So, I can't so here's the cool thing, right? Yes. It, you don't have to say anything about money, nothing, right? Mm -hmm. The dog park for me, financial freedom, because I don't have to sit in traffic ever again, right? I've got this gorgeous car, right? That we drive to the dog park. <laughs> I don't have to sit in it to go to work, right? Mm -hmm. I, I love that people buy expensive cars to sit in while they go to work, so they have to work. For me, right? I mean, that that would be quite nice getting my nails done. Yep. Because that, for me, because I never get them done, <laughs> yep. would, um, I could imagine that that could be like financial freedom. Could be, right? Mm. So the, what, what I find fascinating and, and cool, so here's the thing, right? So are you going to feel good talking about the debt being gone? Remember that guy I used to be married to, the scumbag that beat me? Well, that's part of my past, right? So, yeah, so, 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 so it's uh, still drawing on the past rather than... Well, look what I'm doing now. Oh, yeah. So you're getting your yeah. nails done after a third trip to the Bahamas this year or something like that. <laughs> oh, so you nice. rock in and you go, wow, you know, we got to select a different color because you're so brown. Oh, nice. Get it? So, <laughs> yeah. so what would you do if you didn't have debt? Would you go to the Bahamas? Would you, you know, 
what would you do? And, and there's the fun bit because when you get what would I do differently? How would I? Yeah. You know, so suddenly you've got you know, if, if you want to do a scene for it, you got a scene because you're walking in and you go, wow, yeah, we got to do a color that matches your skin because uh, oh my god, how long were you down there this time? <laughs> Boom, you get it? There's your congratulatory conversation. Yeah, it's something you said a while ago to me, which I never thought of, which was, or uh, anyway, or in one of the programs where yep. it was like, what are the problems that that new state then entails? A oh my God, like, we have oh talked about that all this time. money, and now I've got to get a damn good accountant. You yeah, know, to say, yeah, like ours. Or things like, things like that. Yep. So, yeah. See, that's the cool thing. So yeah. you can also imagine what are the new problems. But we notice all the time, people went, uh, I got an email yesterday, I want to hit the lotto because it'll solve all my problems. And I said, oh, 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 oh. Uh, not a chance, yeah. right? You know, so there's, you know, what are the new problems you're going to have? Picking an accountant, what are the new problems that you're going to have? Where to invest the money? What are the new problems you're going to have? Keeping track of international financial markets. You mm. get it? Yeah. These are good fun. Yeah. So... How about that for openers? That's cool. Victoria, would you like to read yes. reader email number, number two. two? As I was doing a session last evening, I was absentmindedly pressing on my chest and found a lump. Hmm. I immediately did a session about being cured and that the lump was from long ago and with no issue to my health. This morning, am I meant to call my doctor? Already. From Dave. Now, here's what's <laughs> cool. Ready? Uh, only you know the answer. If you're imagining health, right? So, so let me back up. I'm going to take it in a different direction, right? Oh. I imagine wealth. Guess what I love? I love business. I love communication. I love the internet. I tell people all the time. We'll be in the store and I'll be talking to the checkout guy. Talking to one the other day, right? Yeah. My friend Mitch. And Mitch says, yeah, you know, I went to school. I did this, that. And I'm like, dude, you went to school for the internet and you're here? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Yeah. Right? Yeah. The net is not going away. It is not going to die. Yeah. Right? And so, and when I say that, what I'm, what I'm basically saying is, look, you know, you went to school with it, obviously you're interested in it, you're doing this as your main gig right now, right? But for me, when I imagine financial freedom, I love geeking, I love the net thing, I love communication, I love building families, I love this stuff, you know, I love gathering people together around, you know, stuff that matters, right? Uh, so this is what I do all day. This is where I play. Right? I love looking at charts and seeing patterns. I love going, ooh, right? How does that impact me? What am I feeling? What's going on? I love this exploration. So that's what I do. So let's wrap it back in with, do I call the doctor? Okay, if you're imagining health and, and you f feel like calling the doctor, you call the doctor. Because yeah. maybe the doctor has to cut that out, yeah. right? Or maybe the doctor looks at it and says, you don't got a problem. Yeah, it's just right? one of those fatty lumps. Yeah. I got one in my back somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, so there's the cool thing. Right, so it's not about whether or not you call the doctor. There's no decision to be made there if you're living from the state of health. You get it? And by the way, you notice I'm not even saying healed. Yes. Okay, yes. healed. Implies there, yeah. yeah. There so, was something that need healed. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Whenever uh, we've got that health and healing pack and candid creation, but those are on my adventures with extreme hypertension and going to the doctors and so on. I think candid creation was the really good one on freenevel.com, crass commercial message. <laughs> so so when, when I talk in there, I, I mention some things, and one of the things that I mention is I'm not making this about the doctor. I'm making it about me. I'm not making it about a condition, I'm making it about me. So the guy with normal blood pressure or athletic blood pressure, what's his life like? What's he doing? Right? What's his identity like that? Mm. Okay? And that is what I wrap myself into. So when I go to the doctor and she says, it's normal. She says, yeah. Because yeah. actually it's a little low. <laughs> yep. uh, let's talk for a bit. All right. I'm going to test it again. Go ahead. Right. She tested it three times. She goes, I don't understand. You should be on heavy meds. <laughs> yep. Go <Yeah>. away. Bye-bye. <laughs> Not one I comment. Like this is crazy. It's, it's weird not seeing comments and contributions from you guys. Oh, <laughs> I've so, got to get that bit of fluff as well. Sorry. What are you annoying. doing? you got fluff on this your This disturbs shirt. me. <laughs> I'm a victim to her picking it crap. Yeah, well, it's all gone now. That's it. So. Facebook screwed the show up. <laughs> Victoria touched me in all those weird ways. Oh, you see, there's the way I like being touched, right? And then there's this. Yeah. <laughs> okay, remember as a little kid? Yeah. yeah. Oh no. <laughs> right? Oh, I'm a victim to that. Right? No, you're not. Yeah. Right? So she picks the thing off. I can go, what are you doing? Right? We show. Right? But, right? So if I did have any response to it, like, what are you doing? Right? I, I, I can stay there for months. 
right? Tomorrow, don't do that tomorrow. Right? Don't do <laughs> what you show. did yesterday, right? Well, I could lecture anyway. her all morning, and then we can get on the show. <laughs> and then, just the thought of me lecturing her all morning, she could be a victim to that. We could be victims to each other. <laughs> Imagine the crap-ass show. <laughs> uh, <laughs> welcome to crap-ass episode number... <laughs> this is, yeah. yeah, how many people could make that show? Yeah. All right, so Victoria. So there's another quote, is it? Uh, yep. <clears throat> so we might as well say that and uh, do a recap. <laughs> this is, this is lonely. I oh, know. I mean, it's lovely sitting here in the garden with y'all, but, uh, but we're here gosh, I wish we could see your comments. Yeah, because it's like when we can, it's it. Yeah. It's nice. It's like just in a group. Of Even though it just... distracts me. Uh, Victoria yeah. <laughs> interrupts me when it happens. I get upset for days. <laughs> okay, days. so the next Neville got a quote All right. is, There is nothing God cannot do. Do not think that one who is fabulously rich has an influx of spirit which differs from yours. He is imagining wealth, either wittingly or unwittingly. But you can do it knowingly. If he does not know what he is doing, he can lose his wealth and not know how to recover it. I'm asking you, regardless of your financial situation, to assume wealth knowingly. Get how cool that is? Where's that from for Bill? Uh, same article. Same article. All right, so Bill, if you're putting up yeah. comments and people are seeing them, Hopefully. that is from... <laughs> if you manifest something bad, do this at freenevel.com. Yeah. So. Well, you guys, I okay. hope you've made loads of comments. There's we get 13 to read of them. you here, or 12 or something. Yeah, and that we'll read them after the show. So, Victoria. Can watch it? Yes. So, for the recap, what do we tell them? <clears throat> for the recap? Yep. Go to freenevel.com. Yeah, freenevel.com. Join us in manifestingmasterycourse.com. That's right. And for the refunds, go to dealerealfund.com. And at the bottom, because we'll get to see them later. That's right. <laughs> what were your best bits? What'd you learn? What'd you learn about you? Yep. And share the show, share the show. Share the show, share the show, share the show. Thank you for all those show. people that shared it yesterday. It was ace. That was awesome. I think that was probably the most cheers ever. Whatever I had, mm. maybe. Yeah. Way cool. Okay. Mm. So ah. we're going to go to the dog park. We hope you'll, we'll see your comments tomorrow. All right. All right. Let's pretend we're seeing them. I okay. uh, love you guys. See Thank you, Yasmin. You. Look at all those Andrew hearts. Maxwell. Look Yay, at all those Bob. likes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Bill Perry, the official link guy. <laughs> yeah, love you all. Uh, love you guys. We'll <laughs> see you at the free Neville. Dot com. Com. That's right. <laughs> See ya.